Trip, 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 talk, trip, talk, tech. You gotta see it even when it never's far fetched. Gotta believe in yourself in the process until you progress. It ain't complex. Take small steps, it's a long stretch. On the road to the riches, won't be no getting with it. The survival with the fittest, so I'm going to get it. And we doing God's work, we ain't know with no limits. And I'm doing this for y'all, so I'm hoping you get it. Trip, trip, talk, trip, talk, tech. You gotta see it even when it never's far fetched. Gotta believe in yourself in the process until you progress, till you progress. <laughs> Welcome back to Trip Talk Tech. Man, we got a super dope show for y'all today. We're gonna to be talking grounding, which I actually call the healing technology of the earth. But we're gonna be talking about what grounding is, the benefits of grounding, and how we can take, what we can do to take advantage of the benefits that the healing technology of the earth provides. Check it out. At Trip Talk Tech, we ask all our guests, what's your favorite pair of sneakers of all times? Now we ask that question because I believe there's a little sneaker head inside of all of us. And plus I love shoes. However, I was just on my recent visit in Jamaica and I was damn near scalded because I wanted to wear my shoes on my comfortable Yeezy slides around everywhere. As I was walking around, people were telling me, hey, this benefit and that benefit. And, you know, really it's a lot of just ancestral information behind if you really want to dig into, you know, wearing bare feet and getting your, your feet to the ground. But long story short, I heard everybody, you know, I'm going to try to go along with, you know, what it is. So I take the shoes off. But when my feet touch that unpaved ground, or some of them rocks went through my feet or them blades of grass went through when everybody wasn't looking. I'm like, I'm good on this bad feet thing until I get back home and figure out some more information on it. And when I did, the information that I found, check this out. First things first, did you know that our feet actually house more nerves than any other place in our bodies? Somewhere in the region of 8,000 nerves. That's crazy. Earth grounding itself is just the act of having direct skin contact with the earth's surface. That could be either grass, dirt, sand, pick your natural poison. So what happens with earth grounding, we actually, when we walk across the earth's surface, sand, dirt, or grass, what happens is our body absorbs the free ions from the Earth's energy field, which actually acts as an antioxidant for us. These antioxidants actually lead to better overall health performance, both physically and mentally. Some of the other real life health benefits that grounding will help you with, increased energy, improved sleep, reduce inflammation, improve cellular repair, improve tissue repair, enhance blood flow, fellas. Increase heart rate and vitality. Improve electrical activity in the body, meaning, you know, we're electrical. So now your brain is popping, your movements are popping, what you think you're doing, it's a lot quicker. In addition to all of those health benefits, I think the most important health benefit that you'll get from walking or grounding yourself on the earth is actually as you walk on the earth, your body releases the endorphins to the earth. So endorphins from your body leaves and goes into the earth. Why does that matter? You might say this will also help improve your overall health. And actually it actually releasing those endorphins will help you as far as for, uh, help counteract mental illnesses such as anxiety and depression. Let's run that back. As you walk on the earth, your body releases the endorphins to the earth. So endorphins from your body leaves and goes into the earth. Why does that matter? You might say this will also help improve your overall health. Releasing those endorphins will help you counteract mental illnesses such as anxiety and depression. Like we said earlier, walking on the earth's surface reconnects you with nature. But not only that, it actually connects you to the earth's energy field. And that has and you can read it up, but it has so many physical, but also mental health qualities to it that 
it's just beneficial. All right, so we're gonna clean this video real quick because I'm a technology guy, so I'm trying to figure out, okay, how does all of this work? I hear what the earth does, I hear what our bodies, as far as being electrical, how does it all work together? But what happens is the earth's surface carries a negative charge. In our bodies as humans, we carry positive charges. And what happens is when our feet makes that bare contact with the with the earth, grass, dirt, sand, whatever you want to call it, the excess energy that's within us, that positive, if we have too much positive, it gets automatically decharged with the negativity of the earth, which means any tensions that you might have, any blockages, and I'm not saying all blockages in your body, but if you got some energetic blockages or maybe some things that you've been thinking that you thought you haven't released, you know, anything that's clogged within our electrical body circuits, they may be free to the earth in this process and absorbed by nature around us. That's pretty dope. Earth technology is where it's at. Man, mother nature, she is way ahead of her time. Grounding also helps against EMF exposure. You might say, what is EMF exposure? EMF uh, is just uh, low radiation, non-ionizing, so um, not high in numbers, but you gotta think when you start adding all the things up around you, how does those measurements come out as far as being good or bad for you? I don't know, but do the research, check it out for yourself. Some uh, things that you have in your house that are um, uh, uh, emitting EMF, cell phones, microwaves, Wi-Fi devices, um, your refrigerator if it's Wi-Fi capable, your TVs if they're Wi-Fi capable, your lights if they're Wi-Fi capable, power lines outside your house. So you're constantly getting hit. And the other thing, G towers. But all of these things combine to us being with a heck of positive charge. So uh, get outside and make sure you make that contact with the ground. Skin contact with the ground. Ground could be dirt, sand, grass, doesn't matter. Whatever your choice is, take 10 to 15 minutes for yourself out there, relax. I did it. I'm showing you I do it. You can do it too. I didn't believe it at first either, but the benefits outweigh the little bit of uncomfort that you'll go from. And actually, as you do it more, you'll find some other health benefits for your feet, your back, your different bone structures. You might change your shoe size a little bit, but I don't know. Maybe that's me. Hey, let me know what you think down in the comment section. I appreciate y'all. Trip talk tech, y'all. Trip talk, trip talk tech. You gotta see it even when it never's far fetched. Gotta believe in yourself in the process until you progress, till you progress.